growing up around Maury Middle School sounds different for different people. Those who have set up camp on the outside hear cleanup and feel forced out. These are just some of the tactics they've used on people. Advocates heard the word and went to the city and county building to make the mayor hear them. On the other side of these doors, Mayor Hancock was holding a live press conference about public health. Sir, I can't really make out the chance I hear them, uh, but I don't know what it's about. The city views the homeless camp cleanups as a necessary public health measure. And some of these encampments have, quite frankly, down, have spiraled into uh, acute public health threats. And uh, there's a great concern um, when you are allowing feces and needles and other unsanitary conditions to exist, which we have found in some of these encampments, we have to abate them. Instead of making the campers move while the sidewalks are cleaned, this crowd wants the city to give them access to water, bathrooms, and regular trash pickup. I said the mayor wants to listen to you all. He absolutely okay. wants to listen to you all. Loud worked. As he left the press conference, Mayor Hancock agreed to meet with four people to discuss the homeless camps. For about an hour, they spoke in his office. Our cameras weren't allowed in, but protesters live streamed the conversation. The mayor listened. That conversation I was just in there for? Nothing. He has to snow. We're not going to be quiet until he says no more sweet. They'll keep on yelling until the solution sounds the same. In Denver, Katie Eastman, 9 News. Now, during today's press conference, Mayor Hancock said that he is looking at options for sanctioned camping, where the city would provide services like water and bathrooms. And in a statement sent about the meeting, Hancock said he listened to their ideas and looks forward to continuing the conversation.